Does your transmission mount look like this? Then you've got a problem. Stick around and I'll show you how to replace it. So this is the one that's going to be going in, um, replacing what's in there. It sits just like this. Two bolts go down to the frame and then those other two bolt holes that I pointed out to you. So stay tuned and we'll show you how to get this changed out. Okay, so once you get the last bolt out, and you can take all four bolts out without doing any supporting because it's resting on this anyways, but once you get the last one out, that's when you got to get a jack in place, jack on the transmission, do not jack on your drive shaft, jack on the transmission housing here, lift it up enough so the old mount will slide out, we'll slide the new mount in, but because I didn't actually lift my truck on the lift I'm just going to try holding the transmission up with my foot, sliding the old mount out, and then slide the new one in. see it's in two pieces that's no good and now it's just a matter of lining up the bolt holes putting the bolts back in and you're good one left I changed a transmission mount and a Dodge Ram 3500 full wheel drive. If you look now and I push up on the transmission, it is solid and does not come loose from the mount. I cannot break it loose. The whole truck's moving. So there, we need to change a transmission mount, a Dodge Ram 3500. That's how you do it. Four bolts, lift it up. Pull the old one out, put the new one in, bolt it back in, and you're done. Thanks for swinging by Shane's Main Shop. Please like, subscribe, and come back weekly for a new video.